Hello, children. <laughs> that is a pretty cute little tie. However, I need to VIB for a second, so entertain yourself for a little bit, drunken sailor. But hopefully you're well. Anyway, BRB. Hello, children. Welcome. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the Witcher 3. Oh, it's been so long. It's been so long, Geralt. It's felt like forever since we last saw each other. You with that wonderful, rugged, manly look. With the with the armor and the and the gray hair and the scars and the tattoos, oh my good friend, I missed you. I must finish your adventure so we can go to the DLCs as soon as we can. But Jagaz and Lol's Wizard and Drunken Sailor, I said those names in the wrong order. Drunken's been here for hours probably. Welcome, welcome everybody. Jagaz, you are my child. You are all my children. I'm cradling you now in my arms. I will sing to you. Come by, oh my lord. Come by, oh. No, I won't do that. That's not why we're here. We're here to slay some monsters. We are here to slay some monsters. And yes, I did read your whisper, Jagaz, and I considered it. Um, but I also already had the stream up. So, uh, yeah. I'm sorry. No, we'll have to do Mass Effect tomorrow. Ooh! Right. Into a trap. <sighs> ah, delicious. Anyway, in the last episode, we, um, we went on the hunt for a man named Gilles. Eridan had killed Gilles' his king. And Gilles is actually the advisor to Eridan. And so, we wanted Gilles on our side. And so we told him the truth about Gilles' his king, and how Eridan murdered him. And now, when Eridan calls for help, Gilles will not send it. Which is fantastic. Also, this lady is was picking at that bush at the end of the last stream. And now she isn't. Fantastic. We are now in Skelga. Skelga has the Sunstone. And we need the Sunstone to summon Eridan and his Wild Hunt. And then once we summon Eridan and the Wild Hunt, we will be able to lop his head off and eat it. And then he will never ever chase our dear sweet princess Ciri ever again. Life is good. 
Oh my god, good shot, mate. Good shot. All right, we're being chased by bandits. What a fantastic... Oh god, what a burp. Uh, what a fantastic start to the stream. How is everybody? Did I ask that? I know, Jay Gaz, you don't have an appointment anymore, a doctor's appointment. Or it got cancelled anyway. Which is good and bad, I guess, because it's, it's good that you get to stay here, but bad because... I mean, if you have a doctor's appointment, it's probably quite important to, you know, go see the doctor for whatever reason. Now, if it's just a checkup, then, uh, then that's okay. But if not, then, um, holy crap, you, it sucks that it got cancelled. Horus, are you going to struggle? No, you're not going to struggle. Alright, let's read chat here. Apologies for not reading chat, like, straight away. Uh, welcome back DJ, J Gaz, hey, 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 Dots appointments cancelled, so here I am, woo! I thought you wouldn't be here, oh, that's great, really, uh, I checked and you didn't show us live when I sent it. Oh, okay, well, it must have, like, literally been, you sent it, I went live, so, uh, apologies for that. Oh yeah, and that weird painting Gilles did, indeed, with the, with the, with the boob that, that looked at the sky, quite right. May we get you in hot chocolate, which were good, oh my god. What, like in the same meal? Like, did you pour the hot chocolate onto the spaghetti? Because, I mean, that sounds that sounds just awful. But I hope you enjoyed it anyway. A little tired today, so it won't be high energy. Don't worry about it. I'm pretty high energy today. Not quite sure why. I think I had a good night. Yeah, I think I slept well. Yeah, I had fun last night, so that's probably why I'm high energy. Uh, just to check up, haven't seen my primary doctor for over a year, so long overdue. Uh, is have you have you tried to see your primary doctor or have you not seen him because you've not needed him? Because a lot of my friends recently have been talking about America's health service and how when they go to the hospital they don't get seen for like four hours or whenever they try and get into contact with their doctor there's just like no response and um, I've I've heard some awful things like when um, when Mel's mother went to the hospital. She went the first hospital they went to, I think they were there for like four hours in the waiting room and she still wasn't checked. She actually left and went to another hospital to get checked up. So um, it's, I find it quite interesting uh, to, to hear that because uh, uh, whilst America's health service is supposed to be incredibly expensive and whatnot, if you check the league tables of health services in the world, America's is actually still pretty good, no, apparently. No. I think it was like 10th last time I heard. But yeah, when you hear stories like that, it should be like, last. Yeah, well, Watching enough about that. Street. Anyway, yeah. is this Ivan? Oh, hey, they mentioned something. Hey, I've more important matters on my mind. What's up, buddy? By my calculations, today's the day he Gavorg the legendary Who? white whale with the oh. waters of Skellige. Been waiting for this my whole life. Cool. We get to see a whale. I want to see a whale. It's not much better here in England, to be honest. Quite right. But we don't pay for it, so we can't complain too much. Yeah, that's that's the that's the other end. That's the other end of it. We don't pay like money. We have like this free NHS, which is great. But because everybody uses it, resources are so stretched, and so. We don't get the doctors that we need all the time. And so our waiting times are as long as America's. And if you, again, if you look at the league table, I think we're like 8th or 7th or something, which is still not that great. So, I don't know. Apparently France has the best healthcare in the world, but... I mean, who'd want to go to France right now with all the flipping terrorism happen happening, so... Yeah, what a weird thing to talk about on a witch's stream. Doctors are unreliable. You wait about a month to get, a, to, uh, get told to get off medicine. <laughs> Pretty much. Quite right. Anyway, I'll watch for Gavorg the, re the whale with you. Yeah, sure. Let's watch for Gavorg together. And you can tell me what you know about any elven ruins in Skellige. That's right, yes. We're looking for the Sunstone. And they're in elven ruins. In Skellige somewhere. Ooh. I want to see a whale. No one's been able to enter. Good thing too. Else why is it have plundered it long ago like all the others? Oh, there it is! Gavorg! Ah! Ivan! Ivan? What? I... Uh, <sighs> just wanted to assure you I only want to look around the cavern. 
It's research. Research? Um, uh, 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 uh,
Why not, eh? Customer's always right. I mean, he's paying for my services. Let's just go diving. All right. Let's find a black pearl. So the black pearl will probably glow red, whilst the not-so-black pearls will probably glow orange. Hello, I spy. With my little eye, something beginning with black pearl over here, I imagine. Unless it's something else, but I doubt it. I very much doubt it. And hopefully there'll be no monsters. Alright, loot. Pearl. No, that's... Oh, no. Okay, so the red ones are pearls in particular, but they may or may not be black. God damn it. Just chuck him in. I would love to just chuck him in. Although, saying that, I love to get paid. And if those flipping harpies or whatever they are come for me, I will not be best pleased. Alright. Show yourselves to... Oh, yeah, they're coming for me. Oh, they are... Oh, God, hello. Okay. Yeah, right. Alright. Oh, oh, I do not want to drown on this day. Fiends. Fiends of air and water. Alright, where are you, you asshole? Yeah, 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 you think you got me? There you go. There you go. Old Crossbow Joe right now. Oh, yeah. Crossbow Joe. Murdering you all. Anyone else? No? You dead? Sweet. Okay, let's go check this one out then. Geralt, your lungs ain't what they used to be. Let's swim a little faster. That's a pearl. This is good for getting pearls. I don't know if pearls are good in this game. I don't know what you do with them. Maybe you give them to a loved one or something. But for now... Oh god, yep, yeah, swim up. We can't find him. DJ with the name calling. What? What did I... What, what did I say? I've instantly forgotten what I said, because I'm a really good streamer. Um, right. I, I, I can't see any more glowing. How far? Oh, okay, good. Okay, now it starts glowing. Why does it only start glowing when it, it, I get close to it, I wonder? Oh! It, it's going to want me to swim out so deep. And I don't think I can hold my breath for that long. Whew. All right, let's do it. Here we go. Let's do it. If we drown on this day, then let us be known as the guy that tried to save the world. Oh, the whale. See the whale in the background. Oh, I see the whale. That's pretty cool. Please be a black one. Please be a black one. Yes. Victory is ours. All right. We got it. I kind of want to swim to the whale, though. Ivorg, love me. Love me now, Ivorg the whale. Where's it gone? I'm, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, there it is. That's it, right? Do you, do you see it? Should we swim to it? Let's swim to it. That's, that is a whale, right? Surely. Yeah, there it is. Look at it go. Oh, Ivorg. I'm swimming with whales. Well, a whale. Oh, look at it go. Oh, and it vanishes. Oh, that's sex. That's amazing. <laughs> I borg the whale, ladies and gentlemen. What a guy. What a guy. All right, let's get this pearl back to uh, the speller over here. Old King Nidus. Man, we swam up pretty far there. Jesus Christ. What a great... Great way to start your day. Oh, wait. What? Nidus! Why do you have a health bar all of a sudden? Okay, Nidus is in trouble. Yep, yeah, there he is. Yep. Yeah. Oh, God, he's going to die. He is going to die to free drowners. Nidus, run. Run, man. D Nidus, please. Oh, he's got a sword. All right. Okay. Ah! Okay. Nidus, please! Okay. Alright, Nidus. No, Nidus! Oh, Nidus! No! Oh! oh. Ivorg the whale was. was in cahoots with flipping. Uh, the, the, with the drowners. 
Ivorg was like, yeah, drown us. If I, if I get the Witcher to swim further out into ocean, you come up on the dude, on Nidus, and slam him. Take his stuff, and everything will be great. You got that? And the drowners were like, yeah, yeah, we got it, boss. And in the end, we have failed. God damn it. <laughs> Why? Nidus, please. I wouldn't mind, but we just about killed all of them. Nidus. And I would have loved it if Ivorg would have swallowed me as well. That would have been hilarious. Fight my way out of a whale. Or get digested, like, instantly. That could also be a thing. God damn it. I'm highly disappointed. I mean, I have no love for this guy. I've only just met him. But now he's dead. And I will never ever get the money that he owes me. Ah, <laughs> uh, don't worry. Don't worry about it, man. Don't worry about it. It's okay, Jagas. Ugh. Anyway. Basically, the guy that gave us that quest died. Died to a drowning. Quite often in these games, if you stay on the coast for long enough, you're going to have to fight a few drowners. And, uh, yeah, it was too much for our Ninus. Oh, I bet you appreciate that, though. Ooh. Same Jay guys, but it's fun anyway. A status, status story than Titanic. Yeah, quite right. Don't worry about it. I've not had someone who knows much about The Witcher 3 in my stream for a very, very long time, so it's okay. It's fine. Find and talk to the Pearl Diver. Where is the Pearl Diver? No way around it. Gonna have to dive. We call him fish long for a reason. Alright, so he's, what, is he actually underwater? Where is he? Is that, is that him? That might be him, okay. Ah, okay. Alright, find and talk to the Pearl Diver, but we can't really talk to a dead body. That's not how this game works. Florence and what do we have here? I hate diving in this game. Alright, okay, a couple of cool swords, but that's not why we're here. And plus, we're now over encumbered, which is not a good thing at all. Hey, Ties. So, still doing main story. Unfortunately, Ties, yes. So, I fully expect you to uh, be leaving instantly, right? Um, I have my carry weight increased. Unfortunately, that's still not enough. So, we are going to have to drop an item or two. Don't worry about it. You BRB all you want. Do we have a new steel, steel sword? We do. We'll use that for now. We'll get rid of you, because you're quite weak now. Can we drop that? We can. Can we drop you? We can. Probably drop the completely completely the wrong item there, but it's okay. Alright, so is he somewhere under the water already? Is he on the coast? Can't quite see. Uh, sorry, got goodbye. It's okay, Tice. Don't worry about it. I know you're playing through this game. It's fine. I was just saying it would be nice to have someone who knew a little about the game. But um, yeah, it's fine. It's fine, man. You're playing through it. Hopefully, you're enjoying it. Farewell, good sir. Farewell. Hey guys, how you all doing? Pirates. Hey pirates, how you doing? Ah, oh, a day. I mean, I know why you're attacking me. I just burnt your friend to death, but still. Oh, that was for you, Jagas. Uh, good old head decapitation. Head decapitation. As if there were other types of decapitation. Oh my god, there you go. Alright, well, I've killed some guys. Why don't you think you have like 50 swords? <laughs> yeah, you're not wrong. You are not wrong, good sir. But, uh, I'm also grateful that I don't. I'm also carrying a lot of metal. And, uh, an armor in general. Okay, more people coming for me. So beautiful. I know, right? Glad, uh, glad you could enjoy that at the very least. 
All right. Find and talk to the Pearl Diver. He's somewhere within this big yellow circle. He's probably on a job right now. He's probably looking for pearls as we speak. I just drank Ked when he's stout by accident, which is alcohol. So that's a good thing. All right, let's take a look around. Use our witcher sensors. See what we can find. Because we need to find this cavern that has the sunstone in it. Above? Is he on the boat? He's not on the boat, is he? Do I wait for him on the boat? Maybe I... Maybe I just get on the boat. Okay. I'm on a boat. If I take the helm, do things change? No. No, they don't at all. <laughs> uh, it's... I, it certainly blurs your vision. Whether or not it actually gives you, like, minus one in strength or anything, I have absolutely no idea. Uh, where is food and drink? Let me look. No, actually. It, it gives you all positive effects. Apart from the blurred vision. So yeah, 50 vitality regeneration, 50 vitality regeneration during combat, so vitality being life, and then 5 second effect duration. So, lasts for 5 seconds, but you've also got to put up with the blurred, the blurriness as well. He's probably sat in the deck chair laughing at you. You know what? You're probably right. You are probably right. You can't talk to someone who is, uh, is underwater. But then again, Geralt said he was called Fishlung for a reason, so he has to be down here. Somewhere. I love getting stuck in this game. I really do. I really do love getting stuck in this game. Ah, uh, alright, let's have a look-see daisy, shall we? Let's just have a look around here. I mean, if anything important is going to show up, it will show up in red. The only thing I can see are plants right now. Yeah, I can't find them. Nice. Yeah. Could you imagine a world where alcohol has no negative effects apart from a bit of blurred vision? Holy crap. I don't think I'd... I still don't think I'd drink it. Alright. Okay. Oh, what do we do? Find and talk to the Pearl Diver. I have to do my own Googling today. I Google a lot on this stream. I get very, um... I get very sad when I can't figure things out, like, instantly. <laughs> Is there a cave on the wall here? Alright, in, in the wall here. Just like something nice and normal. Find... and... talk... To the Pearl Diver. Yeah, other people have Googled it as well. Holy crap. Googling, boys. Yep. Googling all the way. No, I said Pearl Diver. Pearl Diver Witcher. There you go. Oh, wait, no, wait. I, my, I haven't quite Googled it yet. Here we go. Here we go. We found it. We found it. Okay. I hadn't quite got my Google on yet, and I just accidentally found it. No one's going to believe me, but that is actually a thing. All right. Good. We're back. Wow. I clicked this the Google search button, and I wandered upon this cave. Ah, there you go. Hey, fellas. How you doing? How are you doing? Nice place. I told you we wasn't done for the day. Didn't even have to fish this one out. You daft. Can't you see he's a witcher? What's a witcher doing here? I just wanna... I just wanna ask some questions. Mel! Hey, Mel. Mel, my darling. Run Big hooks, girls. Melly. Not your hand, sir. I love you. Gives, we take. How you doing, Mel? How was work? Seems she's you poor thing. How was work today? I could use a better knife. But a few hours and their fingers are swollen. Uh, heard you know something about elven ruins. That's what we're looking for. We're looking for the ruins that have the flipping that has the flipping sunstone in it. Death cat. Oh, death cat. How you doing, B? 
big guy. Listen, How you doing today? A thing or two about Elven ruins in Skellige. Who says? Permian. Hmm. Half dead from lack of sleep. So Whose fault is that, Mel? <gasps> Whose fault Elven is that? It's okay. Because I love you. And I'm glad you survived. Enter. You poor <laughs> thing. In a cove you can only reach from the sea. But what you exactly... Oh, God. What is it? Ah! Drowners! Sexy! Look at that big old blue butt right there. Alright. Let's dance. Let's dance, big guys. Let's dance. Ah! Yeah, take it. Eat my sword. Do you want to help, Pearl Diver? Oh, God, okay. No! God, there's a lot of them. There is a lot of them right now. Ah! I mean, I don't know why learning a... An aquatic monster would seem like a good idea, but hey, let's get drunk. Let's get some health back. Oh my god, I am dying like a good one right now. Okay, shield on. I need to meditate after this so I can get some health potions back. Okay, you're pretty much dead, and now you're completely dead. I will look at chat in a second. Come here, drowner boy. Oh my god, you're kicking my ass. Can I just bail? Yeah, I'm bailing. See you later, guys. See you later. Have fun with that. Yep, uh, it's it's time for us to bail. It's time for us to bail. I mean, I don't know what makes me think I can outswim a drowner, but we'll give it a go. On this day, cowardice has prevailed. Half dead from lack of sleep. Yeah, Mel, if you want, just, just go take a nap. I really don't mind, because you didn't get much sleep last night, and to be working from half four till whenever, Ugh, that must be an absolute pain. So, yeah, if you want to go sleep, I really, really do not mind at all. I'll miss you, like, like crazy, but, yeah. I think it's probably good that you do that. Yeah, I may have to DJ stream. Eighth day of work in a row tomorrow. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This is why we need to get Melly Moore her sub button, all right? We need to get her to, to quit Starbucks. And to just work from home, Twitch streaming all day for our entertainment. We need to give her all of our money and make her rich, okay? So, if anyone knows anyone who's uber rich and is willing to, to fund Melimore and her, her future successful Twitch stream career. Not that it's not successful already, but I'm talking mega actual, you know, 6,000 viewers successful. Then please, do it. Do it right now. <laughs> but yeah, Mel, seriously, if you need to like sleep now, if you're just like dropping off right now, just I, I honestly don't mind. Um, you you go sleep because, as I said, you didn't get much sleep last night. What? How many? How many? How many hours did you get in the end? Four? Was it? You probably didn't even get four because it probably took you a while to get to sleep, and then once you were asleep, you probably woke up. Melly is going to be successful. It's all a matter of time. Yes, I, I perfectly understand that. But I, I want it for her now. <laughs> I, 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 wa I want her to be the megastar we all know she will be right now. It was like three hours. Oh, God. So effectively, you had a nap before work. I want to sleep. Oh, cigar smoke. Welcome back, good friend. I mean... Should we all just sleep? When I win the lottery, I'm giving everyone money. Same. Same, man. Everyone. Even... No, not Kiratek. Kiratek's too young for that kind of thing. But yeah, Cigar Smoke, welcome to the stream, good sir. Hopefully you are well. I assume you've been smashing up For Honor. I assume you bought it, anyway. I hope that you have, anyway. Anyway, anyway, anyway. There you go. Well, I mean, Melimoy, when you say everyone, like, what do you mean? So, like, Daniel Lee, for instance, does he count in the everyone? Like, how how everyone is everyone in your mind? Jago's mom, I had four, so yeah, I'm pretty tired myself. Oh, God. And you guys get at me for not getting any sleep. Oh, I think I had, like, six hours last night. That's almost normal. <laughs> we all need a group nap. 
<laughs> You're too sweet. Take care of yourself first and others will benefit from your kindness. I mean, quite right there, DC. Quite right there, good sir. Ah, uh, we all need a group nap. There you go, social napping. Let's just all get together and have a big old group nap. Anyone else down for that? I'm down for that. I'll nap with you guys all day long. Oh god, I don't want to fight any of you today. Bugger off, guys. Bugger off. We're going mountain climbing. We're going Skyrimming right now. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> that would be funny, just DJ whispering while we all have our eyes closed. Sweet dreams, children. I love you all so much. Yeah. That was creepy. That wasn't nice at all. That was just creepy. I don't, I don't even my microphone picked that up. Oh my god. Um, okay, I'm working on lunch but sick but working out of town so boss is uh, annoying. I don't say that word. When I didn't want to work. Oh my god, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Cigar. Uh, I mean, like, our group, our closer group of Twitch fam. Yeah. I mean, I've already had this dream. When I win the lottery, I say when, because it's definitely going to happen, I'm going to give Melimore a lot of money. I'm going to give Double Hug a lot of money. I'm going to give Nadette a lot of money. I'm going to give Jagaz a lot of money. I'm going to give Jackal a lot of money for him and his kid. And who else did I say? Ah, uh, this was all a dream, by the way. The list may increase, but this was a dream I had a while. I think I said Yang as well. I think I'm going to give Yang a lot of money as well. Yeah, that was the dream that I had a while ago. So, um, yeah, that's pretty cool. Hey, Yen. Oh, Siri's here too. And Philippa. Hey, ladies, how you all doing? Going somewhere. Siri says there's a site in Skellige we must examine. Avalas clearly hiding something from us. Earlier, when we were in the Isles together, Avalach mentioned a laboratory. Oh. At one point, he wished to teleport there, to retrieve something. And he refused to take me with him. It was all very strange. Sufficiently suspicious, don't you think? Oh, very. Let's have a look up to this time. So what? Want to just sneak in and root around? Exactly. Coming with? Fine. Where is it? On a small isle between Undvik and Spikarog. Not exactly on our way. Just found out the sunstone's on Ard Skellig. Cavern along the coast that we can only access from the sea. Gonna need some real magic to get in, too. Go find this laboratory. I'll explore Ard Skellig. You can join me later. Philippa, your eyesight. Only just recovered and magically simulated. Didn't you say you'd need some time to get accustomed? Ah, that's 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 how Philippa gets around. Interesting. So Philippa is legit blind, as you can imagine. Her eyes more than likely burnt out during the whole mage uh, killing and mage maiming sessions in The Witcher 2. But um, her her eyesight is magically simulated, which makes sense. Because, you know, magic can do everything. Oh my god. Guys, I love how you. J I love how I just watch a cutscene and then suddenly everyone just says a load of crap. And I say crap, I mean crap in the nicest way possible. Um, I would pay for the hotel room just to sleep this off. <laughs> I oh, but poor cigar smoke. Get some sleep, man. Everyone, just get some sleep. It's fine. Oh my god, I can't type. It's alright, Mel. It's because you're tired. You know I miss Raj. We all miss Raj so much. Oh my god. Uh, Triss, Avalok, how you doing, guys? I'm going to do some today, so maybe I can get him back this stream. I hope so. Um, I don't need to talk to you about anything. So long. Alright. Okay, let's grab a boat. And let's head to... Um, the island, I guess, where Avalok's laboratory is located. Unless I can fast travel there. Do I have a fast travel location there? Hopefully I do. Sun-dried Raj. Oh my god. You can't say that. Well, you can actually. It was hilarious the first time round. It's still flipping hilarious. Oh, we do have a fast travel. Fantastic. Okay. Alright. Cool. Avalok's laboratory. Time to get plundered. Alright. Let's get that fast travel location. Let's get over there. Let's do this. 
I want to complete this game very soon. Probably not today, but I want to complete it very soon. That would be nice, right? That would be lovely. And considering that we're doing Mass Effect tomorrow, it's going to be another week until I complete this, more than likely. So, uh, yeah, let's go over here. Bad bang. I'm still in shock. What, at Raj's death? At your first... Well, your only child's first birthday party? Yeah, I'm pretty shocked too. Ah, god damn it. I feel bad. I miss Raj, but... You you give me hope, Mel. You, you tell me that we can bring him back, so... I'm happy. That's all I need to know. Oh, it's just, yeah. Okay. And Siri. I believe we'll find something interesting inside. Okay. So... Any incriminating letters? Closets full of skeletons? They've not even opened the door yet. It's a highly complex magic barrier. Let's try. Okay. Why not? Why in doubt? Let's just try. There you go. Nice. Right? Yeah? We good? Oh, God. Oh, hello. I had, I had a feeling you would come alive, Mr. Golem. That's okay. Three on one ganking. Coming up right now, big sir. Ah! Don't you dare hit me. Don't you bloody dare hit me, big guy. You have got a lot of health. Oh, get out of the way. Get out of the way. You have got a lot of health. But, I mean... Oh, he's not a three on one. Flipping Yen and just keeping the door open. Yen could really use your magic right now. That would be lovely. Can we... Could that be a thing? Maybe? Yeah. Get out of the way. Okay. Calm it down. Siri, I, I've not... Oh, there you go. I was about to say. Not seen you help at all. But that's okay. Because you're helping now. Oh, my God. Please stop breaking my shield. You big, lovely golem, you. Oh, God. Okay. Yeah. I'm really good at this game, guys. Really good at this game. Yeah. Used to be really good at Dark Souls as well. Yeah. But no one would believe me based off this. Siri. There you go. There you go. Siri, use some magic. Use some of that lovely Elder Blood magic that you have. And help me. Help you, you poor old Uncle Geralt. Or whatever my relation is to you. Am I, am I not actually... Maybe because it's my... Maybe because my sword's broke. That makes sense. My sword is slightly broke. That's probably why I can't do much damage to you. God, Golem, please. Where are you going? I'm trying to get out of here. You big silly bugger. You don't fit through doors anymore. Look at you. You're ginormous. Oh, I'm sorry. You're probably really kind of... I don't know. Sensitive about your, your size. It's okay. I still love you, Golem. I just need you to die. Don't hide away. You're beautiful, really. I didn't mean it. Sometimes I just get angry when things attack me. It's just a way of life. Oh, God. I mean... I mean, look at that butt. I mean, I'm sure all the golem ladies would love a bit of that butt, right? Right, Siri? No? Oh, it doesn't matter anyway. You're dead now. Are you going to come alive as well? No? Okay, good. DJ, best video game player. Lies and slander! But I love your lies and slander, Melly. So don't worry about it. Because I love you. Yeah. <laughs> ah! Avalok's secret laboratory! Pretty cozy. Doesn't look much like a lab at all. That proves nothing. <laughs> now he tries to be nice. I am nice. Deathcat knows that. Me and Deathcat are nice guys. Alright. We don't go around murdering everybody. We are nice guys. Am I right, DC? No. That's not me. Where's the skull? It's definitely you. Really captured you. So sure, Avalok's been drawing pictures of Siri. <laughs> Very funny. I wonder why. A little obsessed with her, I think. Okay, Avalok, what have you got to hide around here? Let's have a little goosey gander. Do you know more than you're letting on? I mean, have we ever really trusted you? Oh, okay. I mean, we can talk to Yennefer for a bit. Let's see what she finds. Nice. We are nice. I mean, I'm hoping DC will just, like, swing by and be like, Yeah, he's a nice guy, but... No, he's he's not saying that at all. Oh, okay. Well, I think Mel put a hit on him after the shutdown... Uh, after he shut down her advances. Oh! <gasps> Is that really what happened to Raj? 
Oh my god. Revelation, guys. <laughs> oh wow, okay. Apparently I'm not a nice guy. I'm super bad, it seems. God damn it. Anyway. Uh, it seems someone was literally just here. But Avalok's on the ship. We know that. Avalax on the ship. So who else could be here? He's not. Stop. What? Mm, a distillate. Smells like verbena. Herbs. Not very incriminating. Wait. We've not examined the entire laboratory yet. No, we haven't. All right. Something's going on around here, but there's absolutely nothing to sense. I mean, I guess we got to go deeper. Let's just go a little bit deeper then. What is Avalok up to? Oh, cutscene. <laughs> yep. But your love hearts can always make everything better, Mel. It's okay. Yeah. Don't worry about it. <laughs> oh, wait, what? I missed that from LOL. She saw your Mass Effect character's mustache? Oh my god. So rude, man. So rude. My Mass Effect character is gorgeous. Holy crap, that's a big old family tree. What's all this about? Genealogical chart of the Enhani Care, the Elder Blood, from Laura Doran. To me. You never showed me the full version. I had no idea Viedmont of Eden was an ancestor. Oh, was right. It's everyone that's ever had Elder Blood. Or the one who had his own father's eyes gouged out. Him of the daughters. My, even I'd never seen the full version. Seems Avalark has analyzed all the parts of Lara's gene, even those we thought extinct. So Avalok has been actively searching for people who have elder blood. But why? Let's look at his notes. Let's why is he doing notes. this? I mean, at first, we just thought that perhaps Avalok would want to protect Ciri, but maybe maybe he wants her power for for evil, just like the uh, the Wild Hunt. He was the first to study Lara's gene. Volker? Hmm. Some entries about Ciri, but it's here, later, that things get interesting. He actually tried to cultivate a genetic mix like Ciri's, but one excluding the human line. Meaning what exactly? That I ought to be looking about for giant jars holding my secrets. <laughs> Don't be foolish. Avalok never got that far. Apparently all his experiments ended in failure. You are unique. And that's why we've the wild hunt to contend with. Let's fare it on. See if we can't find something even more interesting. So he tried to make his own specimen that had elder blood in it. Interesting. Didn't quite get that far though. Feels like he's trying to create an army again. Oh god, it's Saren all over again. A magical mirror, maybe. Is this a magical mm -hmm. mirror? Mirror standard. Might have expected a hidden portal. No, no magical mirror. We're getting paranoid about magical mirrors, guys. Hmm. I'll sure know their fragrances. I mean, look, that looks like a magical mirror to me. I mean, I don't really know what would, what use a magical mirror would be, but it's fine. Oh, hello. Oh, a lady. Nudity warning. Oh no, she's clothed. Okay. I thought she was nude. I saw some shoulder and I was like, guys, nudity warning. Okay. Who are you? How did you get in here? I, I mean, I, we mean you no harm, but who are you? Who are you? Not your concern. Get out of here. Now. The Siri Noah? You. I remember you. From Tirnalia. Remarkable. I thought all elves looked alike to those of your race. If it's Avalach you seek, he's not here. I know. And yet you come here. What for? To spy on him. He tries his damnness to save you every time you do something stupid. Is that not enough? What can you possibly know about that? You'd be surprised. He's told me a great deal about you. Uh, for example? Like what? He said you shed Lara's features. I don't see whatever it is he sees. It seems a bit like trying to drink water from a mud puddle. Wow. But I imagine that belief somehow helps him with his task. 
What task? Now, now, ladies. Do you think he trails you everywhere for pleasure? Even I grow ill at the sight of you. It's incredible how those like you still believe you're superior to humans, in any way. She's no human. She's a degenerate half-breed. To have no choice but to use something like that? It's humiliating. Oh, Sarah E. Sarah's being worse, bullied by a filthy work. elf. You'll change nothing. She must do what she must. Then Avalach will finally be free of her. But who are you? That's all I wanted to know. If he hates me so deeply, why didn't he tell me to my face? Oh. I'm sure he doesn't, and when I say, say filthy elf, I don't mean it as a racial kind of slur. If there are any elves in chat, I'm sorry. I love your kind. You are obviously not filthy. You are beautiful creatures. Legolas from Lord of the Rings taught us that. So, I apologize, okay? Uh, didn't I, I mean, it just seems... Like, she was jealous of anything. I'm sure Avalok's still our friend, right? Siri, you didn't actually believe her, did you? She's, uh, personally involved in the matter, that's clear. What of it? If they despise me so, they should leave me be. Oh, Siri, give her a cuddle. Mr. Hogger, someone, please, I'll do it. And who is that woman? Oh, I don't Siri. even know. What? Do you fear I'll level this place like I did Care Morn? Kinda. Shame I can't do that at will because I really like to now. I mean, we could set the place on fire if you want. Go for it. Do it. <laughs> Go on. Tell her to do it. Yeah, that mischievous smile. Here we go. Are we doing it? That's not- that's not leveling the place! Yeah? Oh! Go! Get out, you cheeky bugger! Oh, god. Everything's so subtle in this game. Ah! Oh. Instead of just throwing fire everywhere, you've got this kind of... This cheeky kind of... Byplay between these two. Where one just accidentally pushes a glass bottle off. Flipping tables! Yen, would you like to join in? Table flips all around, guys. Yeah! I mean, they could have just ruined this scene by her casting fire magic or whatever, but no, this is more fun. This has more of an effect. Go on, do it. Oh, hello. Eh, yeah, go on, do it. Burn that picture of Avalok. Yeah! Don't be a shark. Welcome to the stream, man. How you doing, buddy? Not seen you for a little while. Not even seen you for a little while in Melly's stream, I don't think. That was fun. I enjoyed that. Yeah, go on, knock something over, please. There, that's better. Let's get out of here. <laughs> uh, you gotta remember, Siri's still young. She's still young, so to do that with her from time to time, it's fun. It's fun. Busy playing Mass Effect 2 and Witcher 3. No worries, I won't give any spoilers. I appreciate it, my good sir. Thank you for that, Dopius Shark. I will be playing Mass Effect 2 very soon. I've almost completed Mass Effect 1 on stream, so... Yes, uh, if, you're, if you're no spoilers uh, thing could extend to that game as well, I'd appreciate it. But yes, I hope you are well, good sir. I hope you are well. And I'm glad you've been playing all the good games. Meet Siri outside the lab. Let's do it. Let us do it. Do you feel any better, Siri? Do you feel any better? Hopefully you do. Must we return to the boat right away? Something else you want to see? Not here. On Hindisfjall. 
in Lofferton. I met a young man, Skjall. Oh. Like... Um. What is it, Siri? Yeah, Skjall's dad. dead. The Wild Hunt. Everyone? No one survived? Skjall died later. You sure it was him? You'd met him? Uh. I, I saw his body. Will you visit his grave with me? I'd like to... to say goodbye. Uh, yeah, I'll go with you. I'll go with you. Thank you. Could you open a portal to Hindisfjall? I can. Let's go. Let's do this. Come back soon, alright? Mm -hmm. See you. I mean, I don't know, I felt that she was slightly amused, but I don't know. I don't know if you guys will remember Skell, but Skell was the nice boy that, like, kind of healed up Siri. Like, Avalok and Siri fell out of the sky and into, like, the ocean, and Skell was there, I think, fishing at the time? And Skell was that nice boy who took her, took, took her to his mother, they recuperated in the sauna, and in the end, Siri gave him... Uh, a light Especially kiss wondering. before the wild hunt descended on the town of Indusval, and they had to run away. Well, uh, Siri and Skrull had to run away, but Skrull unfortunately then perished. And I think Skrull was the guy that we like, well, not resurrected, but we spoke to from the dead. No, that might have been a different guy, but yeah, Skrull was definitely the fella that Siri um, gave a light kiss to earlier in the game. Let's look together. Let's look around together. Come on. Poor Skrull. I was hoping they'd come back to Skrull. Lasse, son of Njord. Olaf, Necromancy, son of yeah. Is that the guy? Right, okay, Inga, cool. Thank you for Troy. that. Damn it. He's not here. Skrull has no grave. Girl, it was the end who brought I back. Right, good. I bury him. Think. The body. What could have become of it? They didn't burn it. Save that honor for kings and heroes. Doubt they left him in the garden, too. Hmm. Uh, bastards. What? Beyond the village, there's a pit. They fill it with sheep taken by Blackleg. Crabs pick at their bones at night. Oh, wait. Now, they've not thrown Skull in the pit, have they? Oh, more than likely. It's alright, Shark. I mean, if I ever get stuck, which I will, I will more than likely scream to you for help, man, so don't worry about it. Oh, lovely. Is that him? I can't quite remember what he was wearing. Yeah, we probably shouldn't tell Siri about the whole necromancy scene, because that was incredibly uncomfortable. Again, if any of you remember it, he was he was in a lot of well, it looks like he was in a lot of pain anyway, even though he was kind of dead. Ugh. At least we buried him now. It's a shame, really. I think she really liked him. Oh, hello. What do you three want? What are you doing? What you should have done long ago. We're burying Skial. Burying Craven? You defy the right of the Craven, of course. Be yes. Gone. Leave this place. You defy our laws. Your laws don't bind us. We're not bound by them. Aye, and you've clearly no respect for our customs either. Craven's place is in the ditch. Are we fight it. Yeah. Skull saved your bloody lives. The wild hunt was after me. Had Skell not led me away then, why they would have reduced Lofferton to ash? What would the spectres be wanting of some lass who... I am not some lass! And anyone who so much as touches this grave will learn that the hard way. Aye. None will disturb it. Desecrating graves... Well... It's the only thing elders punish harder than fleeing the battlefield. And what you said... Can't know the truth of it. The gods will judge Skell now. Scale will be fine. Whatever the whatever we call the afterlife in the Witcher universe, Scale will be just fine. He'll get looked I after. Right to come. I 
was deeply troubled. I have no idea. Well, they shouldn't spit on his name anymore. Yeah, don't you desecrate that grave. Let's go. There you go. She's happy. Fleeing the battlefield. I mean, I I fleed the battlefield before when a couple of drowners were, um, you know, kind of getting at me. So, yeah. <laughs> God damn it. Together. Back to the boat. Mm. I'm glad this game's doing a lot of fast traveling for me. Even though, it, yeah. Yeah, it makes sense. <laughs> All right, good. So we're no closer to, well, we are a little closer to, are we a little closer? No, we're not a little closer. Hopefully Philippa has found out something about the Sunstone. She's been searching uh, Ard Skellig for the Sunstone. Hopefully she's found the location. Here we go, Skell's grave completed, nice. I love these witches streams where I just have to do nothing. I love being told a story. Alright, so let's take a look at the old quest log. So if we look at Sunstone again, meet Philippa in the Elven Ruins. Uh, oh god. Can I complete Sunstone and then do Veni Vidi Vigo? Or do I need to do this first and get uh, Fringilla from uh, from the boat from the Empress flagship. Do I need to do that now and then do the Sunstone, or can I do both of them whenever I want? I'm going to assume I can do both of them whenever I want. You're actually pretty close to the ending. Am I fantastic? Thank you. I had assumed that, so don't worry. That's not spoilers to me. I had assumed that. You just get a feeling with these games, don't you? I mean, when I went to Ilos in Mass Effect, I was like, this is probably the last planet I'll ever visit. Ooh, side quests, side quests everywhere. Yeah. Yeah, look at all these, eh? Look at all these. Look at all these secondary side quests. Look at them. Look at all of them. Look at all these filthy side quests I still haven't done. I mean, I've done a lot of them already. If you look at my completed quests, there's flipping loads of them. Done loads of them. Look how many I've done. So many. And yet there's still so much to do. <laughs> God damn it. But that's the thing about a streams playthrough. When you do a streams playthrough, I mean, you don't have to take this as, like, some kind of massive tip. Because I know someone like DC is playing Fallout 4, and he's just finding all the stuff to do in the world. Probably because he's completed the game so many times. But when you're doing a first-time streams playthrough, I like to keep it kind of short, in a way. And the reason why I like to keep it kind of short is because I want replayability. I'd like to think that I'll play this game on stream again. And so next time round, I will do the side quests that I haven't done like in my first time playthrough. I think it just makes good sense. When you said that quest name, my mind went straight to Ghostbusters 2. He is Vigo. Ah, <laughs> oh, I've never seen Ghostbusters 2. I'm so sorry, but I'm sure that was a, a hilarious reference. And I'm glad it reminded you of it. Uh, yeah, you can do the Sunstone first, thank you. Oh yeah, to help you out plenty for later, I would get the Moon Dust Bomb. You can buy the diagram for them at the Herbalist Hut, just north northeast of Oxenford. Interesting. The funny thing is, Dopiest, I've actually just not used a bomb at all in this game, <laughs> apart from when I've needed to as a quest, so uh, I'll, I'll look into that. But, I mean, I'm going into the DLC like straight after this, so uh, yeah. Uh, I will look into that, good sir. Am I going to need to sail around this? I'm more than likely going to need to sail around this. If you look uh, where we need to go, we need to go up here. And it doesn't look like there's much of a path unless we take take it to here. But then we'd need to mountain climb. I feel we may need to boat here. So let's go grab a boat. Oh, which DLC? Well, we, we have both of them. So... Uh, is it Hearts of Stone first? And then Blood and Wine? I don't know. I'd check right now, but I gotta get a boat. 
I gotta get a boat. Too much dilly dallying around, good sir. Off to work later. Alright, cigar smoke. Have a wonderful day, sir. Or try to, anyway. I know work isn't always pleasant, but uh, I don't know. You might enjoy your job. So, yeah. Try and have a wonderful day, good sir. And thank you for dropping by. <gasps> Woo! Alright. Let's take a boat. Whee! Boop. Okay. Nope. Don't jump. Find that helm. Find it. There you go. Nope. That's the wrong button, Jonesy. Ah! When it says press the green button, also known as A, you should press the green button. Also known as A. Which, uh, what are you doing? There you go. Cool. Mountain climbing, bring a horse. <laughs> the mountains in these games, not quite as accessible as the ones in Skyrim. So, uh, I have a feeling we're boating. Yeah, this is this unfortunately isn't quite like Skyrim. So, uh, yeah. We're gonna go on a boat. We're gonna boat for a bit. Yeah, horse and stone. Right, okay. Like, you can't kill your horse, right? What, in this game? Pass. I mean, our horse is our personal horse in this game. Uh, it's a horse called Roach. So I suppose it would kind of be like us killing a pona in The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Oh, Ivorg, the whale. Is that Ivorg the whale? <gasps> Ivorg, no. Ah, oh, Ivorg. I don't know if that's actually Ivorg. For those of you that missed it earlier, we uh, we got to see a whale called Ivorg, and uh, he was beautiful. Can't typing. <laughs> Mel, don't worry about it. You just sit back, relax, and be wonderful. <laughs> God damn, you poor thing. I love you, Mel. I love you. I'm so glad that you're actually here in the stream. To be honest, I've I've had a feeling you'd come into my stream and you'd be like, Dan, I love you and all, but I'm dead right now, and I kind of need to sleep. So, uh, yeah, have a good stream. I'll talk to you later. Oh, here we go. Are we, go are we gonna have a boat humper? <laughs> yeah, we are. Boat humpers, boys. Yep, gonna have some boat humping. Oh, no, it actually did damage my boat sometimes. Shark, I don't know if you've experienced this glitch, but sometimes the uh, the flappy bird things will grab onto my boat and they just won't break it. They'll just pump the life out of it. Like this guy right here. See, look, he's not actually breaking the boat. He's just kind of humping the life out of it. Have I gone too far? Let me just check. Dan, I love you, but I am dead. <laughs> Don't say that. Oh, my poor Mel. Well, again, if you want to sleep, you can do it. I always just shoot them off with the crossbow. Well, I mean, I kind of just love the idea of them humping my boat. But of course, now they actually decide to damage it. Oh, fine. Okay. Uh, can I crossbow? Oh, I can. That's hilarious. <laughs> what are you doing on my boat? Get off my boat. This is my boat. But yeah, like, first time they grabbed on, they just humped the life out of it. Also, you're taking the long way around. It's okay. Don't worry about it. I love sailing my boat. It's fine. Savage boat humping. Quite right. We've had some some rather savage boat humping moments in this game. Oh, spoils of war. Interesting. Yeah, I mean, we could have gone under the arch, I imagine. We could have gone under the arch, which makes up the bridge to the actual main keep which we should probably see right now. If we could look up, we could, but to the right, we should see where the the banquet happened. Yeah, and that's the bridge that we jumped off. We could have just gone through there, but I'm a big dum-dum, you see. I'm a big dum-dum, and sometimes we, uh, we miss things like that. See, that's the arch. We could have sailed right through that. Dopius Shark is absolutely right, but I'm on a boat, and I'm enjoying my time here, so it's fine. Ah! Drive by! Take that. Holy crap, that was fun. Who else wants them? Anyone else wants them? Oh, hello. Hello. You're dead. Go away. Get off my boat. Get off my boat! This boat is not for humping! Reload faster! Oh my god, everyone is humping my boat! Guys, stop humping my boat! God, if only my neighbors could hear me now. Oh, seriously, sirens. Seriously, stop humping my boat. Yeah, yeah, you, you want to hump my boat? No boat humping for you. Your boat humping days are over. 
All right, I think we're good. And we are not taking on water. Yeah, yeah, we're taking the scenic route. Quite right. I mean, look at these lovely mountains. I mean, I can't look up at the mountains, unfortunately. But this middle bit of the mountain, yeah, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool indeed. Smuggler's cash, very nice. All right, are we close? At least it's a boat and not you. Quite right. Although I'm sure Geralt would probably love to get humped by a monster one day. I mean, he has been humping all his life. Not gonna lie, Lol's wizard. He's um, he's plowed his way through pretty much everything which can be plowed in the Witcher universe. Uh, demons like uh, succubus, uh, ladies, and all that. Uh, women, elves, probably. Just, just pretty much anything. He's probably had Liara from Mass Effect 1 as well. So, I mean, moving on to boat humping demons like that. Yeah, sure. Why not? Why not? Geralt would love that. Alright, let's go see what's in here then. Meet Philippa in the Elven Ruins. Just wonderful. Hey, baby. How you doing? Another door we can't open. Yabby, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, shark. Don't worry about it, good sir. Oh, we can't open Let's go. We get, we get to do a what quest now? with Philippa. Philippa, before we sleep. move on, let me sleep just for a little bit. There you go. Plus, how are you going to stop? Ex how are you going to explain stop humping me to the neighbors? <laughs> just a regular Wednesday for me, man. Holy crap. Yep. All right, let's go, Philippa. Also heard of this rich blind dwarf from Mahakam. Had them put two sizable rubies in his eye sockets. Couldn't see a damned thing. <laughs> it looked pretty tasty. Yeah. Lovely. I mean, who wouldn't want rubies for eyes? Oh god. Hear that? Those look like my lurk eggs, though. That scared the life out of me. Alright. What have we got in here? Hello. Okay. Harpy? Are you a harpy? We can kill harpies. We just killed a bunch of them. Oh God! All right. No, it's it's a pretty magical siren. Holy crap! Okay, Philippa, go get him! Go get him, girly! Holy crap! Okay, okay. We found a place of power. Not important right now. All right. Ah, siren, please. Boom! Take that. Headshot. Boom! Headshot. Come on, come over here. Siren, don't you do it. Don't you fly away from me. All right, murder it. Murder it face off. No, he got away. Philippa, you okay, Dolo? I mean, Philippa's not going to die. Fucking Philippa Eilhart. Greatest mage of them all, probably. Although she can't cast magic missile very well. Completely missed with that shot. Boom! Headshot. All right. We good? Yeah, we are. Okay, there we go. As I was going to say before, my computer started messing with me. I always check my surroundings very thoroughly. Yep, I'm not that guy. I am definitely not that guy, Dopius. I apologize if, uh, if that annoys you, but I am not the most observant, and I'm not the most thorough. For example, you may have realized that I actually have some level ups available to me, but I'm not using them. I'm going to wait until I actually need something specific. So that way I can either expect where the enemies can come from, or to make sure there isn't a shorter route. Okay, cool. Okay, I'm back. What did I miss? Light everything. Everything drunken. But welcome back to the stream. Welcome back. Hopefully, uh, dinner, was it? Hopefully dinner went well. Some drowners and a siren. Yeah, I mean, that that was... She's been BRB for a while. But yeah, you, you missed quite a bit. The stairs? I'll fix them right away. Just normal difficulty. I'm playing for story, not for challenge, so, uh, yeah, just normal difficulty. Oh, hello. Magical bridge. Oh, my God. Let's go. Oh, Philippa, you really are the life of the party. That was... That was amazing. Do you wanna... Do you wanna cross your own magical bridge? Triss plays the big sister to Siri. Even yeah. awaits a chance to hop in bed with you. You and Yennefer play the parents. Yeah, so if you're going to make it a five, someone's craving the <laughs> Wow. Okay. Yeah. 
I love that. It is a bit of a weird situation between me Yed, and Triss. Let's just not talk about it whilst we're trying to fight a golem. Alright. Oh god, Philippa, please. I mean, Philippa, do you want to- Oh my god. If you want to join in on our fivesome, then that's okay, too. I mean, I don't know, you might be super freaky and all that. And Geralt does like the super freaky one. Oh my god. Again, Dopia Shark. I've been playing this game for a little while now, and I still don't know how to fight. I mean, you could probably give me all the big tips, but to be quite frank, I think my... I think my lack of skill, I don't think anyone can really help with it. I do my best. I use Quen whenever I can, and that kind of ensures that I don't die anywhere near as much as I uh, as I really should. But uh, yeah, I'm not I'm not great at this game. Even though it's on normal, I'm not great at this game. You will never see a Death March playthrough from me. That, uh, let's just say that Death March is like the hardest difficulty in the game. So uh, yeah, you'll never see that from me. I mean, you you may actually see that my sword is still broken. I don't think I'm actually using that sword right now, but I should really be fixing my sword. That probably doesn't help me in fights. But, uh, yeah, there you go. God damn it. God damn it. Oh, God. I mean, this guy's probably really weak to something. Like, I don't know, maybe Ard or Igni or Axie or something, and yet I don't take the time to explore these things. Instead, I just use my sword, minor dodges from time to time. Didn't realize he could do that attack. That was brand new. And I just use Quen a lot. Quen is pretty oh, Quen is pretty much okay. To have a shield that protects you from one hit, that's pretty good. We're big fans of that. And it's the only way I can actually play this game. So, uh, yeah, thank you, CD Project Red, or whatever you're called, for including Quen in this game. And all the other Witcher games as well. All right, we're good. Nope, but Ard can help. Right, okay. Yeah, uh, Jackal a while ago said that I should get the the make food last longer perk. I don't think I have it though. Do I have it? Let me see. I'm gonna assume that's a brown perk, right? Let me take a look. Uh, make food last longer. Do I have it? Is it a brown perk or is it a green perk? Oh, I do have it. I do have it. I just don't have it activated. And now I've activated it in the wrong place, because I'm really good at this game. All right. I do actually have it. Okay. I think, yeah, I think I got it, and I was waiting to get my last slot. And I know this is a bit of a mess as well. I know I can get, like, 50 more HP out of this Vitality Mutagen. I don't think there's a brown Mutagen, is there? Is there a brown Mutagen? Like, what's this one? I think that's just green, right? Yeah, okay, cool. I don't know, is there such thing as a brown mutagen? Yeah, you have it, but not equipped. Yeah, yeah, I just saw that. Because that would be interesting to know. I don't know what a brown mutagen would give, but if there is such thing as a brown mutagen, that would be quite useful to uh, to know right now. Because I always thought it was just green, red, and blue. Ah, what have we found here? What now? It appears I must do everything. See the sentry who seems to be waiting for payment. I'm fresh out of change. Oh, in blood, not coin. The sentry is no free. brown mutagen. Oh, right. Okay. Cool. You Thank you. Read oh God! I always hate it when people do that. Ah! You just casually cut their palm. Sure. Have my blood. Ah! You see it so much in these fantasy games and fantasy films and yeah, fantasy what? TV series. It's like, we are blood brothers forever. And they just slash their palm and I'm just so screamish about it. It's like, ugh, God, cringeworthy. <sighs> but I'm just, I'm just delicate. <sighs> so yeah, that's probably why. Guarantee the lodge's safety. What's your take on it? My take? Obviously a leading question. No. Geralt, I'm tired. Let's sit and chat a bit first. Is foreplay that important to you? <laughs> Why, yes. Yes, it is. <laughs> Deal with Emir. 
Uh, sorry, the deal with Emir is, uh, it's Sorceress's business. Yeah, it's fine. It's not my business. It's the, uh, it's, it's to do with the Sorceresses. Yen's got it under control. It's fine. Yeah, I never understood how a blood seal can work in general. Yeah. I don't know. Some kind of weird old time me tradition, I guess. This deal with Emir. It's Sorceress business. Pick someone else's brain. So she's not told you anything? What about personal plans? Has she mentioned anything? A possible advisory position? Beside a young, promising empress? Stay away from Ciri. She's an adult, Geralt. You keep forgetting. She can decide for herself. Yeah, true. So, onward. Oh my god, Philippa, just busting our balls, man. What are you doing? Time you stopped interfering in Ciri's life? No. But you do know we're not a pack of wolves you can just drive away from her with your sword. Sure you are. And yes, I can, if the need arises. God damn it. She's always getting at us. She's always getting at, at us. If she was in my stream right now, she would be the one face palming constantly. God damn it. Wait. Oh. There's something here. Feel it? What do you feel? No. My medallion. A ridiculous bauble. It made me laugh. Tuning into elven magic is just slightly more difficult than sniffing out a malodorous fiend. Arahan Luma! Fancy. Alright, well what's that done for us? Oh, oh, hello. What's that? It's a giant spider, isn't it? No, it's not a giant spider egg. Fantastic. The sunstone is here. Don't stand there looking stupid. Try to shift the mirrors. Oh no! Don't. Ah! Is this? Ah! Though I may be, uh, yeah. Uh, though I may be good, I always am um, a bit fast with learning these kinds of things. Yeah. Don't worry. I'm slow and dopey at learning things in video games. It's all right. I'll openly admit this. Watching the video of Witcher, he was being given a side quest, and he kept saying no. Oh really? Oh. <laughs> cool. <laughs> uh. Okay, so we got ourselves a mirror puzzle, and now I I suddenly feel kind of kind of afraid now because Dopiest knows what he's doing, and he'll be like, "Oh, DJ, you're really bad at this." Oh my god. Alright, let's see how these mirrors move then, first of all. I assume we have to move these mirrors, so let's see how they move first of all. Oh god, there's not really much we can do until we know what happens. So let's just use this one and see what happens. Okay, so when we do that, we turn it away. But when we turn it on, it shines to that one. But what is our end goal here? I'm not quite sure. Let's check out the other mirrors. Oh god, yeah, I forgot. <laughs> Geralt does not like fall damage. Let's try the other mirrors as well, just in case. We need to make sure we know what each one does before we can proceed there. Uh, oh, oh god. Hello, ghost, how are you doing? I'm probably gonna have to use, uh, Erden, maybe? Will that work? Yeah, there you go. There you go. There you go. I don't know if that works or not, but uh, yeah, he's slowed down in uh, in the Erden field, so that's kind of useful at least. Ah! I should really dodge. I should really learn to dodge instead of just rolling everywhere. There you go. All right. Let me let me turn this then. So where does this? What does this do when I turn it? So that shines it to that one. Okay. And let's see what this one does as well. Can we get to this one? I mean, probably not from down here. How do we get to that one? I assume that we can get to that one somehow. Is there a little side bit or a little cave that I don't know about? Oh, I'd have to hit him two times. Oh, I just dropped my phone like a flopping idiot. Oh, I'm so sorry. So that way you can kind of stun him. Right, okay. I mean, 
that didn't slow him down a little bit, but yeah, it didn't really stop him from uh, <laughs> killing me. So, uh, yeah. It's worth a try. How do I get to that mirror? Like, I mean, there's a cabin here. Maybe it goes all the way around? Let's take a look. Let's take a look around here. No. No cabin around. Interesting. Side bit. Is there a side bit? I mean, I see a ghost up there, so we must have to go up there to check it out. I mean, is it... Oh, oh, over here. Is it over here? Darn rocks in my way. Yeah, it's over here. Right, okay, cool. Cool. Kill, kill, kill. Yep, rocks are cool, guys. Rocks are so cool. Sedimentary. Oh, God, I love it. All right, so you said R would be good for stunning. Hello, Mr. Ghost Man. Oh, get r -ded. All right, so that stuns him for a little bit. If I was closer, it probably would have done a lot more. It feels so that I can just damage him normally, so we might actually just go with Quen, unless he's got some kind of magical ability as a ghost to get through my Quen shield. Although saying that, I'm actually fighting him quite majestically here. Not that time, though. As soon as I said the word majestically, I get my ass kicked. Alright, what does this mirror do? So... not much. Okay. So how would this work? I'll figure this out, even if it's just blind luck. I'm going to assume that perhaps we need to get light from the mirrors. Well, obviously not from the mirrors. The the beam. I mean, I mean, well, I mean, there's light from that mirror. Oh, God, I don't know. I don't bloody know, do I? I'm just pressing random buttons. I'm, and I also can't jump. I also can't jump. I'm going to try and figure this out. For a small moment, guys, I'm not going to be looking at chat. So, Dopiest, I know you're probably there, being the helpful guy that you are, and I love it. And normally I'd accept it. But for now, I'm gonna pull levers. Oh! Ah! I did it! Was there? Was there, was there a chest? Oh. I can't see much detail graphics. Yeah, apologies for that. Um, I did it. I did it, guys. I did it. I'm the best. Oh, yep! Yeah, stop doing that! I'm saving. I don't trust myself. <laughs> I don't trust myself. <laughs> oh yeah. Let's um Let's stop doing that. In fact, let's meditate as well. In fact, let's just meditate. I don't even know why I use the potion. Let's just meditate, get back to full health. Waste a bit of alcohol. Due to my idiocy. Holy crap. Was there another chest as well? It's alright, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. We don't loot as much as we should in this game. Right, well, your eyes are a lot more... eagerly than mine. Alright, what have we got here? Oh, the actual sunstone. Ah. At last. Hand it over and let's get out of here. Not so fast. We have a matter to discuss. Oh, Philippa. You gotta fly. You're about to tell me why you need the Sunstone so much more than we do. Then you'll change into an owl and whoosh. No idea where you got such a ridiculous notion. Siri's safety is most important to me now. Right. And I wish to talk to you about the future. My future. <sighs> yeah, I mean, you're bound to be hunted still. Yeah, I mean, I should loot more for... Just, just for repair kits, really. I do have a bunch of swords already, so I've just been switching between, like, my broken sword and the next strongest sword, but eventually I will need to repair them. I mean, the Emperor's probably got plans for you. Wouldn't worry. Emperor's got plans for you, I'm sure. Stop playing the jester and listen to me carefully. Once we've right. defeated the hunt and Siri is safe, Yennefer's meteoric rise at the Imperial Court will come to an abrupt end. Which is wonderful from my perspective. I'm not interested in reviving the Lodge if I'm not to have the deciding vote. You're telling me this because? If I know even one bit, 
I expect that once we've defeated the Wild Hunt, you aim to slip out the back door with Siri. To disappear into the wilds, correct? Sounds, Sounds good to me. Romantic. But perhaps instead of destroying the girl's life, you could take Yennefer with you and go. Oh. Okay. Triss might object. Ah, yes. So give Yennefer some friendly advice, would you? She'll listen to you. Yeah. Quite an obvious plan. Let's get rid of Yen and, uh... Philippa can become Emia's sorceress to go, you know, the ones, the sorceress that he will come to all the time, I'm sure. Interesting. You want to Let's question that. Place at Amir's side. And at Ciri's. I think you understand it's inevitable. And I would truly prefer Yennefer to be far away when it happens. Holding her in the Imperial Dungeon would be costly. And it would give the wrong impression. All right. Done? Question mark. Can we go? Any other words of wisdom? Or can we go? You may go. I know you <laughs> things to do. <laughs> You're right. You're quite right. You are quite right indeed. I don't like doing things the easy way. Consider it more of a challenge. Do I actually have to get out of here on my own? I do, don't I? Fantastic. God damn it. <laughs> um, okay, good. So that is now updated. So we've done the Sunstone. There were two main quests when we got here to Skellige. We had the Sunstone and we had Veni Vidi Vigo. We need to get a young lady called Fringilla off of the Emperor's ship. She's being held captive. And so we need to sneak on. Under the cover of darkness, obviously. Uh, if we can actually get out of this cave. Which, uh, oh my god, is it this way? Is it this way? I think it's this way, right? Is it this way? Yeah, it's this way. Um, and uh, yes, we need to go and save Fringilla, one of the other mage ladies. And once we have all of the little mage ladies, we can start destroying the wild hunt, hopefully. Fingers crossed. Braves. Oh, hello. How you doing? Nice to meet you. Can I just, like, sidestep you guys? Oh, no. No, I cannot sidestep you guys. I cannot sidestep you guys at all. This was just the wrong place to go. You know what? Screw you. Oh, you're going to chase me, aren't you? All right, fine, fine, fine. Mm. All right. Okay, okay. We're going to go with Quen. We're, we're going to choose to protect ourselves. Try to, anyway. There you go. Nice kick, mate. Nice kick. Oh, I'm stuck in it. Pretty tough place right now. Oh, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm doing so well. If I keep telling myself that one day, I'll believe it. Even though you guys more than likely won't. Alright. Good poke, mate. Good poke. Yep. Got hit by that one. Fighting two ghosts at once. To me, highly impressive. To anyone else, not so much. But that's alright. Because I've killed one already. Through, shim, through sheer uh, button bashing. You may even be able to hear. The furious button bashing right now. You can hear it, guys. Does it sound good? In Death March, I would have died four times over. Four is, is probably an understatement. It'll probably be more. It'll probably be like 40. But yeah, we did it. All right, dope. This is for you, man. A Redanian halberdier's armor. This one's for you, man. We're looting this. Oh, I'm overweight. <laughs> That's why I don't loot. I just realized. That's why I've not been looting, because, uh, yeah, I'm kind of overweight right now. Uh, alright, cool. God damn it. Do you want to look at my swords, Dopiest? Look at all my swords. Do you like my swords, Dopiest? Look at all my swords. Is that good armor? 156 plays 90. It is good armor. And it's medium armor compared to... Medium armor. How do I look in that? Oh! Oh! Oh, how majestic! Oh, baby! Cool. Right. We need to drop a bit of weight anyway. So, let's get rid of 
that. And then let's get rid of that. Alright, cool. DJ, stop telling people to look at your sword. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I will. I'm sorry. Oh, man. How majestic do I look right now? I don't know where I'm going. Do I get some kind of local map in this game? I don't even know. Do I? Do I get a local map? No, I do not. Alright. This is it. This is the stream. Upstart DJ versus cave. How do we escape? Is it over here? Is this where we go? I don't think this is where we go. I think this leads us back to the room with the gem? No? Is this literally where we just were? No, this feels new. Well, as in, like, not the gem room, maybe? Oh my god, I'm so lost. I'm so flipping lost. Why doesn't this game have a local map? Oh my god! What are you? What are you? What the hell is that? I've never seen that before. Yeah, I think that is the way out, really. Oh, okay. God damn it. I, I, I don't know what that is. What the hell are you? Um... Oh god, it's roaring at me. Alright, sure. Why not? Why not? In for a penny, in for a pound. Let's do it. Oh, you're an Arrakis. Okay, cool. Okay. I'm gonna imagine Arrakis's, or Arrakai, like to be burned. Oh, hello. Yep, yeah, okay. String shot. Super effective. Do you wanna... Okay, cool. Uh, that was fun. Miss that, Igni. Really good at this game. Oh, and that's poison gas. Okay. Okay, we want to get out of that. We want to get out of that. I already re regret fighting you, Mr. Arrakis. Or Mrs. Arrakis. Holy crap. Yeah, are you actually sucking the... Oh, oh, that... Ah, that pumps up your little poisonous bomb. Maybe if I burn you whilst you have that bomb on your back. No. Doesn't work. Maybe if I burn... Oh my god. You know what, Mr. Arrakis? You win. You win. Or do you win? Ha 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 can I cheese this? No, I can't cheese this. Alright. You know what? I want you dead. I want you dead. Come on. Come here, you bugger. Oh, yeah, that's poisonous gas. No, okay, so when he's got a full sack. Ah, he just gets me instantly. And I'm still poisoned. Yeah. You know Let's get out of here. We don't need to be here. Let's just get out of here. Do you have any bombs? Nope. Oh, I can burn the gas? Oh, I can burn the... Holy crap. I can burn the gas. You're quite right. I forgot about that. <sighs> I don't want to kill him. But I kind of want to kill him. I want to, but... I don't want to. Yeah, maybe I should. Maybe I should try and explode him. I'd like to just tease him. Oh, wait. Hold on. Hold on. Does that work? Oh, that's only one damage. Okay, we can't cheese him with that then. Alright. We're gonna try it. We're gonna burn you, you bugger. Come here. Nice. Right, get close. Get close. No, we didn't do it that time. Yeah, you missed that time, big guy. Alright, come on. There you go. Brilliant. That didn't do as much as I hoped. Alright, we're out of here. We're out of here. On this day, cowardice has been shown. Tactical retreat. Quite right. Tactical retreat. Let's just get out of here. Oh my god! Oh. Since when were the traps there? That's what was hitting me. I do have tons of food. I'm just using potions. <laughs> 
Yeah, I don't think it's flammable gas, or not like explodey gas anyway. And I didn't realize the traps were there. That was indeed the wrong way. Yeah, we're not going that way. We're not going that way this time. <laughs> I just want to get out of this cave. Ooh, baby. All right, so we now know what a venomous arrakis looks like. I, I'm very well aware of what an arrakis looks like from Gwent, but uh, not from the actual game itself. I don't think... Have I seen an arrakis before in this game? I think there was plenty in The Witcher 2, but not in this one. All right. So this is the gem room. So how do we get out of here? What about up here? Yes, here, near La to you as well. Oh, God. Oh, maybe just up here? Screw you guys, I'm out of here. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Just the tiniest bit of detailing. I'm probably not going to be able to climb this anyway, right? Nope, it's going to let me. Is it going to let me? No. All right, bring it. Bring it. Bring it right now. Burn for me, ghosts. Burn for me. And then quad. Oh, God. Okay. Dopiest. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry that, like, your first experience of my Witcher 3 stream is uh, you having to help me out of pretty much every situation. I mean, you're probably thinking to yourself, Yo, DJ, based off today, I've, ab I've absolutely no idea how you've even got this far. I mean, I understand. And I get that. But it's alright. It's alright, buddy. Because together will make it. Because you see, my stream isn't really about entertainment. That's not what it's about. It's about seeing a guy against all odds figure stuff out. You know, I'm not good at video games. Anyone will tell you. If Jay Gaz is still here, she would probably face palm to show that off right now. But, um, yeah. Uh, I, I'm not great. And so it's, mo it's mainly about me trying to... Uh, figure things out, and when we do, we celebrate. Kind of, in a way. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, that, that's pretty much what it's all about. Um, oh god, I actually gently drink K20 Stout. You know, we'll drink one more. Oh my god, I'm drinking all my alcohol! What am I doing? Do I actually have any food, or am I literally down to, like, my alcohols right now? Also, if you read that book about the monsters, yes, I'm very well aware of the, uh, about the, uh, of the bestiary. I do use it from time to time. I just wanted to go in and kill that guy. Yes, you are right. I am completely out of food. Holy crap. All right, we need to go get some food, guys. We need to we need to go get some food. All right, where the hell am I going? I don't know where I'm going right now. <laughs> you are down to your alcohols. Yeah, I just seen that, man. I just seen that. I just seen that, man. I just seen that. Alright. What's up here? More ghosts. I mean, I don't know why we just couldn't be portaled out. I mean, the thing is, once we actually get out of here, we're probably going to have to boat again. Come over here, good friend. Oh, you got a friend, have you? That's interesting. That's good to know. Alright, okay, calm down. Okay, calm down. Calm down. I got this. Alright. There you go. Yeah, I don't you to hit your friend. How does that make you feel? Oh. Okay. Okay, please. <laughs> Ghosts, be nice to me. Ah, there he is. Because Geralt hates portals. I mean, I know that. I know. But he has gone through portals before, so... I mean, it's not really an excuse anymore. <laughs> he has gone through portals sometimes. <laughs> Ah. Just because you hate something doesn't mean you can't do it anymore. Alright, come out here. Come out here, big guys. Come out here. Let me show you what I can do with my with my awfully broken sword. Alright. Alright, one down. There you go. There you go. See, 1v1? I can just plow him. Plow him down. Alright, what's up here? I feel like going up is a great idea. Right? Going up is great. We like going up. Going up is fantastic. No, it just leads to a different cave. Oh my god. Where am I now? 
No, I will not throw down my blade. Friend? Not friend. Why would it be friend? It's a flipping goal. Go for Nebia, friend. Not good. <laughs> Eventually it will, though. Eventually it will. My good old sword. I mean, it's still doing good damage. You're on your way out. Am I? What, do you mean just in general, or, uh, like... I mean, I am... I, I am pretty old right now. Am I on my way out? Is that what you're saying? Or are you saying that I'm close to the exit? If you're saying I'm close to the exit, then that's good news. Three hits, then Ardor, Ardor Igni. Alright, cool. You're just full of tips today, aren't you, dope? You are just full of tips, man. Good for you, bruh. Good for you. Alright, let's see if this is the way? I mean... White dots are telling me to go... Ah! 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 No, that is not the way! This is the way! Ha! Ah, sweet freedom! Ha! Ah, wait, Monster Den? Oh, God! Okay. I don't like it when my controller just rumbles. Yes, the door. I saw it, man. I saw it. Don't you worry about it. There you go. Panic over. Dope. Take a break, man. You did it. You did it. You got me out of there, man. Take a break. Your hands must be killing you from all that typing. It's fine. We got there in the end, man. We did it. You and me. High five. Yeah. Can't actually high five you because you're not actually here. But still. High five, man. We did it. We succeeded. Hey, guys. Regular human beings. How you all doing? Woo. We did it. All right. Sneak onto the Empress flagship under the cover of darkness. I think we're going to do that next time. But we will at least get close to where we need to go. Save. <laughs> Guess ready to see a good show of DJ sliding down a mountain. No, none of that, man. Unless I need to do that now. <laughs> Hopefully not. Right, let's head to Marlin Coast. Yes, we will save after we teleport. The Witcher is very good with its saves. There is quite a lot of auto saving going on, so... Yeah, we should be fine either way. But we will drop a proper save... Once we arrive at Marlin Coast, on the Isle of Undvik, with all those beautiful clearing boats, up. it is clearing up. You're quite right, Geralt. You're quite right. Is there some kind of blacksmith around here? I don't know if there is. I doubt there is, actually. It's just a coast, isn't it? It's not an actual kind of town or city. I mean, we can take a look at our swords right now. Do I actually have a repair kit? No, I do not. Alright, fair enough. So for now, what we can do is... Hopefully... Yeah, Disclare. 313, 383. I know we can press a button to compare, but I can't remember which one it is. This is actually a much better sword. We'll use that one for now. Alright, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Alright, then save. We need to save right now. Alright, we now have the Sunstone. Finally. We can now evolve our Surskit, which is good. So, next thing we need to do is we need to sneak onto the Emperor's flagship under the cover of darkness. As you can quite clearly see, it's not actually that dark. So, let's head to about 10pm, maybe? 10pm is pretty dark, right? I mean, it's dark right here, right now. It's only 7-ish p.m. Well, 10 to 7 right now. Flipping dark here in England. But no, we'll get to 10 p.m. Nice and dark. Kinda. Let's see if we can sneak on right now. Yeah, we got five minutes. Let's see if we can sneak on right now. I mean, we can probably take a boat. No, 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 actually, no. We will not take a boat. Taking a boat would be a silly idea, because he'd probably see it. So let's not take a boat. Let's instead dive underwater and swim over there. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's swim under the boat and hopefully not get seen. I mean, the light is right there. But you can't see me, right, guys? No? Okay, good. We're probably going to get seen as soon as we surface. <laughs> this was such a bad idea. <laughs> Eh? Eh? An assassin, let fly! 
No, they've seen me. Oh wait, I didn't see that. I didn't see, actually see that it was about there. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Bad idea. Retreat, guys. Retreat. No sneaking has been done here. Okay. All right. Run away. You you saw nothing. Return to your stations. Okay. Whew. This is going to be tricky. I guess what we could do is we could swim underneath all of the boats. Like, how close are we to the boat? Yeah, we could swim underneath all of the boats and get to the Empress flagship. Let's see if that works. Because they're only going to see me because of the light, I imagine. Here we go. Here we go. I mean, th there is a potion for w water breathing, I think, isn't there, dope? Yeah, there you go. Potion of breathing longer underwater. I think that is actually its title. I think that's actually what it's called. Breathing, a uh, potion of breathing longer underwater. I think that's actually what it's called. Alright. Watch out for the lights. I mean, the lights are everywhere. Come on. You can make it. You can make it, Geralt. You can make it. Don't you worry about it. Right, this must be the Empress ship over here, I guess. Maybe? Oh my god, they're everywhere! Take a breath, then go under. Shoot him. Take a breath. Do we actually need to identify which one the Emperor's ship is? Because I don't know. Let's figure that out for next time. Is it this one? I guess it's... Is it this one? I don't even know which one the Emperor's ship is. Right, okay. Why does Google have to mess with Twitch? I have absolutely no idea, good friend. No idea at all. Oh, are we safe here? Oh, that that's a bigger ship. We're safe here. Alright, interesting. So which one is the Emperor's ship? Maybe Witcher senses would help out here? I have no, I have no idea. I think once we get onto a boat, maybe. Maybe it's this one. If it is actually this one, then... Can we... Can we just... Can we just get on? No, don't shoot! Don't shoot! You see nothing. Cover of darkness. Google does mess with everything. Oh my god. Oh my god! How are you so good at shooting things? Yeah, you see nothing. You see nothing. You see nothing right now. No, you see nothing. Stand down? No, no. I want to climb up this anchor. How do I even climb onto these boats? Or maybe it's that one. Oh no, it's definitely this one. All right, it is definitely this one. All right, use. We're on. Sorry, we found a way through. I didn't even plan on doing this right now. Didn't even plan on sneaking on, but I thought it might be useful to kind of explore what we need to do right now so we can do it next time. Uh-oh. Emir! Hey, buddy. Pleasant surprise. How you doing, big guy? That was glitchy. Well, welcome. Thank you, your majesty. You should have come with my daughter. Your welcome would have been different. Where is she? Uh, I don't want you... Well, I mean, if I say... If I say... Zeracania... He's just gonna know I'm lying. Watch. In Zeracania, she longed for sunlight. I am known neither for my sense of humor nor for my patience. There you go. You're insolent because you believe I cannot afford to hurt you. And you're right. Yet that will change one day when you are no longer indispensable but disposable. Oh, I'm here. But you talk a big way. game. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. What do you want? Fringilla Vigo. Been told you promised Yennefer you'd free her. I can see. I know you're a busy man. So here's a letter. Ought to refresh your memory about the lodge. 
Even Yennefer's humblest requests seem like threats. <laughs> Tell me about it. About Very well, so be it. All right, cool. Time for time for me way. to go. At last, a point we agree on. Guards, bring me Fringilla Vigo. You may remove her Dimeritian shackles. You're not gonna kill her right in front of me, are you? You're gonna do it, aren't you? Oh, Emir, please. I don't want this. No introductions are necessary from what I've heard. Farewell. Fringilla. Killer Whale, that's what it's Been called. Oh. Oh, Fringilla, you look lovely. The other sorceresses, they're on Ginvale near Ard Skellig. We can take a boat. I'm sick to death of boats. How could you be sick to... Oh, I mean, you have been, you know, <laughs> captured and... You 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 were in prison I on a boat for a while. And have it your way. Let's go. See, look, he still uses portals. Even though he hates them, he can still he still goes through them. So why couldn't Philip have just said, "Hey, you know what? Here's a portal. I'm quite nice sometimes. Here's a portal, and we can get you out of this cave instantly." Oh, Philip! God, I hate her. I hate her so much. Why does he do this to me? God damn it, Philip! God damn it. There you go. Danny Vidi Vigo is done. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, we are on we are we are pretty much towards the end of the game. We are we are here. Let Avalok know everything is ready for the final battle with Eridan. And his wild hunt, maybe. But unfortunately, ladies and gentlemen, I've got to save my game and I've got to get out of here. So, uh, yeah, ladies and gentlemen, thank you all. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you all for watching. Um, hopefully, you've all enjoyed yourself. Dopey Shark, thank you for the help today. Really do appreciate it. And everyone else, thank you all for watching. Uh, tomorrow, we will be finishing Mass Effect 1. So, please be there for that if you want to see the end of Mass Effect 1. If you don't, then do other things but if you do want to see the end of mass effect one with me your boy upstart dj then be there tomorrow 5 p.m gmt anyway ladies and gentlemen have a fantastic day mellow more for the love of god get some sleep and uh, yeah i love you all have a good night see you all next time goodbye goodbye goodbye, goodbye.